Hi students, today we are going to learn about the uh, equation reducible to the linear form. So linear form uh, normally the division there will be no variable. Division number can be there, we call it as a fraction but here you can see in the division in the variable but it can be reducible to the linear form. That's what we are going to see here. Right? So here the division is a 3x. If you bring that it will become a multiplication. Right? So 8x minus 3 is equal to 2 into 3x. So 8x minus 3 is equal to 3 to the 6x. Now it is a linear form, right? Just bring a 6x here, this side it will become a subtraction. So 8x minus 6x is equal to minus 3. If you take that side, it will become a plus 3. So 8 minus 6, 8, 8 minus 6, 8x minus 6x, it will become a 2x. So 2x is equal to 3 and x is equal to 3 by Right? That's the answer. And here we go for the next problem. 7y plus 4 divided by y plus 2 is equal to minus 4 by 3. So this we, whole thing we consider as a one term. It's a division. So I will bring here. And 3 just take to that side. It will become multiplication. So 3 into 7y plus 4. Multiple to the whole term. The same here. The minus 4 is multiplying with this whole term. y plus so 3 into 7y is a 21y plus 4 3 is a 12 is equal to minus 4 into y is a minus 4y minus 2 plus is minus 4 to the 8. So minus 4 I bring here to plus and my plus 12 will become minus 12. So 21y plus 4y is equal to minus 8 will become a minus 12. Plus 12 bring that to become minus 12. So 21 plus 4 is a 25y is equal to minus 8 minus 12 is a minus 20 so y is equal to minus 20 divided by 25 and 5 is the factor it's a 4 times it's a 5 times so y is equal to minus 4 by 5 that's the value for minus 4 by 5 so here we go for the odd problem the ages of Harry and Harry are in the ratio 5 is to 7 4 years from now, the ratio of the age will be 3 is to 4. So, it's given in the ratio. Let me consider the common ratio as a x. So, the Harry age will be the 5x and Harry age will be the 7x. So, let Harry age be 5x. It's given in the year, right? Yes. And Harry age be the 7. So, 7x yes so according to the con condition in the given the question according to the question four years from now so four years from now after four years what will be the harry's age 5x plus 4 and uh, harry age also will become 7x plus 4 right four years from now right the ratio of the age will be 3 is to 4. So 4 is from now, these two ratios also will be a 3 is to 4. So 5x plus 4 ratio to the 7x plus 4 will be equal to 3 is to 4. So ratio we can write in the form of the fraction, right? So 5x plus 4 divided by 7x plus 4 is equal to 3 by 4. So now just take this entire term to here. So it will become multiplication since it is in the division. Here 4 is in the division. So if you take here it will be a multiplication. The 4 multiple the both the terms right. So 4 into 5x plus 4 is equal to 3 into 7x plus 4. So 4 multiples the both. 5 4 are 20x plus 4 4 are 16 is equal to 7 is are 21x plus 4 3 is a 12. So now it's just normal linear. So let you bring here 21x. So it will become a subtraction. 16 will become a subtraction there. So 20x minus 21x is equal to 12 minus 16. 20 minus 21 is a minus 6. Because 21 is a greater. So minus is equal to 12 minus 16 is a 4. Minus 4. Right. So then minus x is equal to minus 4. Then x is equal to plus 4. Right, so x is the common ratio, but here is we have to find the year age. 
so our age is 5x so x value is the 4 so our age will be 5 4 are 20 and her age is the 4 7 4 are 28 right therefore Aries age is 5 into 4 is equal to 20 years and Harry's age is 7 into 4 is equal to 28 years. Clear? So here we go for the next word problem. The denominator of a rational number is greater than its numerator by 8. So, rational number is in the form of P by Q, that's numerator and denominator. Your denominator is compared with the numerator A, numerator. So, let me consider the numerator as a X. So, let the numerator of rational number be X. Clear? Then what is the denominator? Denominator is given greater than its numerator by 8 so greater than this by 8 that is x plus 8 so therefore the denominator is x plus 8 so given greater than numerator by 8 right next so next according to the question if the numerator is increased by 17 so numerator is increased by 17 means x plus 17 and denominator is decreased by 1 means x plus 8 minus 1 then the number obtained is 3 by 2 so numerator is increased by 17 so you look at my x plus 17 divided by and denominator is decreasing by 1 so x plus 8 is a denominator it's decreased by 1 then the number obtained is 3 by 2 clear that's it. Now just take this. We can change to linear equation. So this is the entire term. We can take this side and this term. We can take this side. Before that we can solve your 8 minus 1 is the 7. So 8 x plus 17 divided by x plus 7 is equal to 3 by 2. Now you take our multiplication. This side it will become a 2 into x plus 17. Here the 3 into x plus 7 so the 2 will be multiplying inside it will become a 2x plus 17 into 2 is a 34 is equal to 3 into x is a 3x plus 3 into 7 is a 21 just bring an x term here and number the so 2x minus 3x is equal to 21 is the minus 34 2x minus 3x is a minus 1x so I represent the minus x is equal to 21 minus 34 is a 13 it's a greater number is minus so minus sorry, minus 13 right so minus x is equal to minus 13 then plus x will be is equal to plus 13 right so the x is the numerator and the denominator is a x plus 8 so 13 plus 8 is the denominator so therefore uh, numerator is 13 and denominator is 13 plus 8 so 13 plus 8 is nothing 21 so therefore you have to write in the rational number right therefore the rational number is 13 by 21. Clear? Thank you.